six bow and arrow variations in 90 seconds. With your underhook, feed their collar to your top hand, grab it, grab their knee, kick your bottom leg across their waist, bring your top leg over their shoulder, cross your ankles, and hip in to finish with a tap. This may be a basic jujitsu choke, but it still has a high percentage finishing rate. And once you have the top grip, you can also reach to their opposite gi with your underhook hand and hip in to get the tap. And when you go to hip in, it's important that you separate your chest from their back to increase leverage. And you can also finish this by bringing your free hand behind their neck for a half Nelson. This is most effective against people that like to stack their weight off to one side. And if you're going for the basic bow and arrow, but they block your leg from coming over their shoulder, you can wedge it behind their neck to finish. I found this finish to be extremely helpful in dealing with those people that are difficult to choke. And if while you're going for the choke, they stack their weight onto you, keep your shoulder behind their neck, pull your weight out from under them, shrimp out, and then you can grab their knee and finish the choke from their side. This is another excellent finish I found to be effective against those guys that are good at scrambling out of bad positions. From turtle, grab their collar, slide it through for the bow and arrow grip, then you can throw your hook across, roll on your shoulder, and hook their leg for the finish. I've hit this before in competition. It generally happens when your opponent has a good base and is comfortable to stay in turtle. Alright guys, those are all the chokes we're going over today. If you guys have one of these that you think you're going to end up using the most, let me know what it is down in the comments below. And if you're still watching, I'd say you probably found the video helpful, so be sure to hit that thumbs up button. It really helps me out. If you guys would like to see more videos just like this one where I give you practical jujitsu advice that you can use the next time that you're on the mats, then be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell because I post two new videos a week. As always guys, stay consistent. I will talk to you on Friday. Peace. I don't talk, I get it Yeah, you know I'm fine to but kill me, I'ma let it Run into the bag like I'm so athletic I've been up since six, making hits like tennis I've been on fire, I just need my credit